Hi bleepers, how the devil are you? Okay, so we're gonna get out for what, just an hour. Yeah. Just, just a quick one, just wanted to see Matt hang out with him. Um, it's on an interesting field though. It's where Mark had his gold um, and some other just weird, I think I had a Roman off of it as well. There's a link to that video there. Very, very interesting little field, but we're gonna just hit it for a little bit. But you've just told me that he's got it until March. Yep. So we are adding it's the best field out of all, every, all of my permissions. It's Lucky bugger. Fun. Lucky bugger. So this is Detector Matt, my friend Matt, my very good close friend Matt, who's now a metal detectorist. Well, he has been for a while now. Uh, there's a link to his channel below, so go check that out as well. Give us a watch. Should we go? Let's do it. Oh, look at that. It's a star or a sun. It's a sun, isn't it? Or a flower. Or a flower. Fantastic. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm like I'm the gold king at the moment. I've got a stator. I've got my first stator. And we said yesterday when we were detecting, I said if I ever get a stator, I'm quitting because that's that's what I need. <laughs> that's my that is my number one find is a gold oh stator. My oh my god, Matt! Look at that! Look at the back. Flick it over. I don't Show the back. I've never seen. I don't understand what that is. I've never seen that on a stator before. Does anyone know those markings? Please comment below. Oh my God! That's my number one find. That is my number one find, a gold stator, man. It is a stator, isn't it? It has to be. It's, it's some sort of stator. It's definitely gold. It's absolutely gold. Oh, it is ancient. It is beautiful. It come out there using the uh, uh, gold max today. Why is it not focusing in? Hold on one second. There you go. I'm using the gold max today. I've got to be fair. Um, so, because Matt's you using my 6MX. Yeah, 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 let me, hold on, let me Yeah, yeah, have, let's have a bleep of the 6. Oh, wow. I think I'm going to have a heart attack and die. Think it over here, bro. That is beautiful. Yeah, okay. Uh, the surface find there she is, right there. Oh, hold on. There you go. Now it's single, it's just you went over it quickly. Yeah, yes. and there's a, there's, you're getting a little grunt because there's, there's a bit of iron next to it. I can't believe it, it is so beautiful. This is my number one want, guys. This is the one thing that I've always wanted out of metal detecting is a stator. Celtic, because I'm half Irish, and it's like... That's a beautiful thing, mate. Oh, my God, it's beautiful. It's it's better than my guinea. Dude, it's amazing. I prefer that, I, I prefer that to my gold guinea that I just found a couple of weeks. A couple of weeks ago? I oh, know. And this is my field. This is the field we wanted to do for ages. This is it, man. It's gonna be the one. This is it. Oh wow. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna carry on. I just can't stop looking at it. It's just wonderful. Look at that. Now let's find some more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's, should we stay around this area? 100%. Okay. That's very interesting. Right next to where the coin was. Yeah. I'm doing a video. Sorry. <laughs> he thinks I'm talking to him. It's like, uh, it's definitely works, it looks very old. Nothing obvious, but interesting. It could be a pin of some sort. Right, okay, this is getting really, really, really interesting now. I've just had this, and I don't know what that is. It's, it's a coin of something, this, but it's got like all sorts of nice, weird little designs on that. Very, very thin, could be Celtic again or Roman. And then right next to that, Matt's had this some sort of mount or that's weird isn't look, it look it's got links of chain in it yeah and it's really thin like copper or bronze or so it's got you see the green yeah, discoloration yeah. that's cool man that is cool stay around this area man. I, i'm going to <laughs> <laughs> now matt's found this matt just found this weird coin thing well, it looks like a bud doesn't it but look you can see writing on the outside there get this it's the same the other side more right in there. Some sort of shapes. Look. It's even the edge looks like it's been stamped with Frank like a coin, look. See the road where it's been rolled? Yeah. Oh that's no, milled. It's definitely milled. It's a milled coin, but I don't understand how they why that's there. That's weird. And here look. Some sort of markings on it. You just got another beautiful one as well actually. It looked like a bell. I'll have to show you that in a bit. You know, 
I don't even know what to say. I can't, <laughs> I can't sh show your face because it shows where we are. That's right, I'm I don't even know what to say, Matt. Um, just some weird things have happened. Um, I'm not going to say, no one's going to believe me. It's, this is, it's, it's, Mate, even, I was here, I believe you. Yeah, okay, so anyway, we found an area and we found, I've just found this matrix seal, a really nice, really old one. Look at that. With this spiral, which says to me, maybe Celtic. I don't know if they even used matrix seals in Celtic times. I doubt they did. But it, that is old. That well, it's got for some, sealing paper, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, and I don't think that, no, writing and, no, it wouldn't have been. But it's definitely it a matrix It could be seal. something else. It could be um, a weight. But no, surely not. I mean, that's, I don't know. I just don't. It's old. It's a matrix seal, I'm sure of it. It could be a, a, game, a game piece. You don't know from a, an ancient game. It could be, yeah, it could be. But why would they spiral the bottom? No, I don't know. I'm saying matrix seal, but why would it be circular like that? Normally it's a crest or a family emblem or something, you know? Yeah, yeah. That's weird. It's lovely though. It's, it's lovely. lovely. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah. So I've just found a dragon. An old uh, mount of some sort. It's obviously just silver plated, look. But yeah, that's a dragon. Oh my God, that is an actual dragon. Wow. That is cool, man. Look at it. The, wor the worst thing about that, Matt, is that we've got to go do the school run. <laughs> yes, we have. We've got to go, we have to go. So we gave it, we, we, we said about an hour, but it we ended up tear ourselves that. away, but we're it was gonna, hard. We're gonna go back there again, and Matt will be documenting that, uh, that field as well on his actual channel. So let's have a look at what we got. Probably in order of interest for me, I'd love to know what that is. Yeah, I say that's a, it's a bit of a, I don't know. It's, it is circular, so it, on it, it could be a bit of a, a brooch of some sort. But it's got look how it's like made into like chain links. I know. Yeah, that's cool. That is cool. That is cool. Okay. And what else? You've got, got some nice buttons. A couple there's, of nice buttons. There's one yeah. I didn't document. I think. What was that one? No, it's that one there. I didn't get on the field. That's quite a nice little it's button. Like no, 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 light's fine. Light's fine. It's really, really good. Nice and clear. And then there's this one as well that Matt got. Can you give me a focus, baby? Yes. Yeah. There is something on that, but look. I know. I thought it looked Chinese. Like that way, I thought it looked kind of like a Chinese writing like that. See? Oh, yeah. Can you see? Yeah, I can. So there's that. Now, there's this really odd. Yeah, it don't. looks like a coin, but it's probably a button. We've got no idea what's going on here. I think that that is a button, but they push that something through and crimp it on when it's got the ring. Yeah. So it goes through. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Maybe. Uh, but we were in a site where I got a really a weird thing happen to me. I'm not going to say it because they won't believe me. But a weird thing happened to me. It's like it's, there's been some really creepy things happen, like yes. the morning ring. I haven't had gold in my life, gold coins. I find two gold coins within two videos of each other. I've had gold rings, haven't I? Yeah. I've had plenty of gold rings. But I've never had any gold coins. I find a gold sovereign, that not sovereign. The, that was the other thing. A gold um, guinea. Yeah, I think that's just a rivet maybe or something. Not sure. And the rest is to Pretty much. Uh, so I get a gold guinea and then I go and get myself a blooming gold stator. Oh man. That is just I can't even, it's just the one thing I've always wanted. People people have the thing, and I was happy about the guinea. I love the guinea, but that is just beautiful. It's, just, it's the history side of things. That is, like you said earlier, that has been in the ground for a couple of thousand years. And I'm just so interested in the Celtic history because of my like uh, background as well. Of course. But um, I don't know much about, I, I know that you get staters, I know, I know that you get half staters. I'm wondering if you get quarter staters because this looks... I don't know if that's a half stator or a, a quarter stator. Oh. Yeah, of course, of course. I'll put it up on my Addicted to Bleeps Facebook as well. People are really good up there. So there's the back as well. Oh, man, it's beautiful. Yes. So there you go. You have a fiddle with that. Uh, and, of course, this buckley thing as well, which is also pretty awesome. That is cool. Not far away. We stayed in the one area. Mm -hmm. That's probably 200 square metres, I reckon. Yeah. This, I'm not sure what that is, but I'm just saying that's probably something old, an old artifact of some sort. Um, possibly, uh, we came up next to the stator, so possibly a Roman or a 
some sort of Celtic code. I'm not sure if I did old coppers in Celtic, not sure. And then just, and if this hunt was just that, or just that, you know, or, or just the stator, I would be happy. But I've got all of these three amazing items in one. That could be a plum weight as well, you know, but then again, why would they do that to the bottom of it? And that's that, that design screams Celtic to me. You saw the plum mate I got as well recently, and it was just the, the proper design, the round with the... Yeah, you don't, the they, 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 if it's a plum weight, right? So it's a part of engineering. It's how to figure out if things are flat or not. You, there's no need to decorate them. No, exactly that. I don't know. Anybody, any guy, any of you got any ideas? So that's it now. Ended of a, uh, end of Addicted to Bleep's YouTube channel. I'm afraid. <laughs> I, didn't know what I said. I said if I get a Celtic stator, I'm done. That's that's what I've. That's the one thing that I've been in this hobby for. I just wanted a Celtic stator. I've got it now. If you give up on that field now, we've just got that field. I think you're mad. <laughs> I can't give up on it, can I? No, you can't. Thank you for watching, my friends, and we'll see you in the next video. See you soon. Check out my channel, guys. See you later.